Edwards F-22 Raptor completed a test flight March 18th on a 50-50 fuel blend of conventional petroleum-based JP-8 and a hydro-treated renewable jet fuel known as HRJ. This flight test marked the first time this type of biofuel has been used in a fifth-generation fighter like the F-22. We've tested SPK prior on this jet uh, with a blend with, eight, uh, with JP-8. Uh, this time we're testing the HRJ which is a bio SPK on the F-22 with the blend of JP-8. So during the data analysis, we're going to determine what the differences are between Fisher Trope SPK and the hydrogen renewable jet fuel of the bio SPK. Uh, this analysis has not been performed yet, and we're also comparing against the, the baseline JP-8. So we're going to compare the three different fuel types and see what the differences are. The flight was a capstone in a series of ground and flight test events conducted by the F-22 Combined Test Force using HRJ in the F-22. The overall test objective was to evaluate biofuel fuel blend suitability in the F-22 weapon system. The Raptor performed nearly an hour and a half of maneuvers that included supersonic and supercruise test points. Big picture, it was a, it was a great success, uh, mostly because uh, we had a pretty short timeline to do this. Uh, and uh, everybody pulled together in order to make the testing work out well, to make the planning work out well, and to ultimately have a successful test on Friday uh, in a short amount of time. Once the data is reviewed and once uh, we look through everything, uh, the next thing will be a certification to allow this fuel blend to ultimately be used on the F-22, uh, and then future testing then uh, to allow this fuel blend to perhaps be used in other fighter-sized aircraft as well, like uh, the F-15 or the A-10. In February, Air Force officials certified the entire C-17 Globemaster III fleet for unrestricted flight operations using the HRJ biofuel blend. Jet Fabera, Edwards Air Force Base, California. This has been Dateline Edwards. If you have questions or comments, we'd like to hear from you. Please send us an email at channel.6 at edwards.af.mil.